What is up, RC enthusiasts? Check it out. This is what I got next right here for myself. I was a little interested in this because I just wanted a cell checker that showed all the cells at once instead of those simple little ones, which, you know, they did me well for a while. No problems with them whatsoever. But this guy right here, this guy right here, not only functions as a cell checker, it also functions as a USB charger for my stuff I need to charge, and I can do that while using my LiPo batteries to charge with. In the field and everything and while camping, that's very convenient for me. Well, once you open the box, you're greeted with this little card, some little ISDT stickers, a little screen protector, which is awesome because I love putting screen protectors on anything that has a screen, and the device itself. Stuck in there. Here it is, the device itself, pretty handheld, nice little size. There's your USB side right there to charge with. And, oh yeah, obviously to update port right there too. And there's your XT60 and connector right there for your eight cell, up to eight cell LiPos to check all eight cells at once right here. That's pretty cool. And just when you thought it was done, you get a lanyard in the box. Awesome. All right, to make this simple, I already have a battery that has an XT60 style connector. Plugged it in there. There you go. I boot it up real quick and said bat go. Let me see if I can get that on camera. There you go. And now it's just gonna automatically, well, it's not gonna automatically read the cells, but if you plug this port in, you can actually use this as a USB charge. Press start, plug in a USB device or USB charging cable right here, and you can plug in your phones. And it's a fast charger, so it will fast charge your devices. And that's one reason I got it as well, because I used to use something else that was, I don't know, kind of generic and unsafe looking compared to something more like this, which I would, wouldn't mind having this laying around charging my batteries and stuff. So yeah, you don't have to have this port plug. This is just if you need it to power this up. Now, if you're just going to check your cells, you unplug this. And you just plug your cells in here. The very top one right there is going to be your negative and it's marked right there. And that turns it on as well. And there you go, it shows you all your cells voltages. As you can tell, mine are pretty close to each other. This battery's been sitting in storage for two months now. So that's pretty good. And over here, you can balance these cells, so it'll balance it out for me, which I probably will do for this one. As you can tell, it's gonna pull voltage from the higher cells to balance them all out. Should be a pretty fast one for this, because they're really close, but yeah, we don't have to sit here for that. Other stuff on the menu. Alarm tones, battery type, low voltage alarm, USB charge, cell balance, and back. So there you go. I'm pretty sure this model might be updated already because all these things I see here on the side, on the first run of these, those I think weren't on there. And this is just a firmware update. So if you have the older version of this one, or not older, same version, but you have an older firmware in yours, you can go ahead and download the newer firmware on their website and make it just like this one. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Pretty simple system information right here. It's got the newest OS, I believe. You got your volume, put that middle. Power save mode, backlight. Yeah, other than that, that's pretty much it. It's just a battery checker, but a really nice one that can charge your stuff right here. I'm gonna go ahead and plug my cell phone into here just to make sure this thing charges. But now I'm in USB charge, as you can tell. It says right there, I don't have any draw coming out of it because I don't have my phone plugged into this end yet. So I'm gonna plug it in right now and let's see what kind of draws we get out of this. My phone is turned off. Ooh, she's making some noises. One amp so far. And my phone shows fast charging. So that's cool, guys. It's making that weird noise, though. I don't know what's up with that. Kind of scary. Maybe I gotta unplug this. I'll try right now. That changed nothing. Weird noise. <laughs> so yeah, guys. This thing right here for me 
it's a recommend if you want something to charge on the go. You know, you need to charge your devices while you're out camping or anything. It's a fast charger right here. Very compact. Take anywhere with you. Just put it in your battery bag or whatever you need to bring with your RC stuff. And you always have a battery checker with you. That's convenient, fast, a balancer, and a charger. Can't go wrong. I know the price is up there, but it does stuff. Well, all right, guys. If you enjoy this kind of content and you want to see more RC-related content with reviews and tips and tricks and videos and bashing videos, go ahead and hit that subscribe. Show me some love, and I'll show you some videos. <laughs> I'm just messing. I'll show you some videos either way. But hit that subscribe if you like. All right, guys. As always, have fun out there. Be safe. And go run that RC.